Hi guys! So I wanted to do a quick outfit of the day for you. I'm sorry that I hadn't filmed in the last little while, but I do have some really cool videos coming up for you this week. So stay tuned. Uh, I'm going to be going over some products that I recommend to clients um, that are found in drugstores that you can get in the cheap as opposed to going to counters and getting some more really expensive products, um, you know, things that you can try out and save a little bit of money. Um, anyway, so I thought I'd show you uh, what I wore. I just got back from finishing makeup with a client. As you can see, my hand is still covered in some things that I was showing her uh, earlier on. Uh, so we were in the makeup portion of her makeover. Uh, anyway, so I just thought I'd show you what I wear uh, when I'm going to see someone. I have to be a little bit more business. So for um, accessories, I have this really beautiful uh, necklace on, which I don't know if I showed you guys before, but this is a stone necklace. It's from Europe. Um, I purchased it at a boutique in Toronto, um, but just really love all the details on it. And actually, um, some of the stones in here have like some little rhinestones, and it's pink and green and just really beautiful. Just a great assortment of different colors so I love the colors on that um, I've also just got some simple studs in because the necklace is so grand so I didn't want to go too over the top for it I also have a Swarovski crystal ring on that I know I've shown all of you in past just got a really fun pink crystal in there which is why I love that one and my old faithful bracelet I wear this one all the time I feel like and this one was from a craft show and that I was gifted um, by family so I wear this one all the time I just love that it's clear and it's gold and it's kind of funky looking so I always tend to resort back to this one and to show the rest of my outfit or actually you know what I'll go over my makeup first so for makeup I have um, Maybelline liquid eyeliner on I just have my regular mascara on no fake lashes today I have hue on my lips with a little bit of lip gloss although most of it sort of faded away but it used to be there um, I also have a uh, benefit eyebrow pencil in for my brows I have um, and I think it's in medium was the color that I'm using on my brow uh, four colors on my for eyeshadows I'm actually using a Sedona lace palette um, which is an assortment of colors. I just kind of went to, through most of the neutrals. It's this palette here, but I'm using these three here and then a couple of the lighter shades on top. So that's what I've got for my eyeshadows. Um, for those of you that haven't tried the Sigma shadows, you can get 88 colors for, I think they're a little bit more expensive than they used to be. I think they're about $24 for 88 colors, but they are great. The colors are really saturated, so I really highly recommend this if you guys haven't tried it. And then the rest of my outfit, so you guys can see, I just have a very simple white blouse on. Um, it's a little bit more fitted. I rolled the cuffs up on it, um, but it does come quite long. So it just comes to my leg break and uh, just rounds nicely in the back. Um, but the cuffs are huge, which is why I love this blouse so much. So just a really great classic blouse. And then on my bottom, I have this great uh, pencil skirt. Oh, sorry. This one is by Brenda Badome, the, the blouse. And I have this sort of... Um, teal colored tank top underneath because I wanted to pull in a little bit of color from the necklace. And uh, for the purple, um, I haven't got a clue who this is by. I actually picked this up at Winners of all things, um, but just like the length because it fell at um, that nice part in my knee, so just really flattering that way. And uh, sorry, I have to keep moving the camera around on you guys. I don't know if you can see my footwear, but I have sort of these printed heels on that's got a mixture of brown and pink and purple and so on and they have a bit of a peep toe. Actually, I'll show you it a little bit closer. I'll take it off. So this is the shoe I'm wearing. This was actually just from Aldo. I've had it for years but I love that it has that little bit of purple in it so I can incorporate it into my dress or sorry my skirt that I'm wearing and then I had a brown Michael Kors bag that I was toting around that I don't have here with me at the moment. It's in the other room. So it had a little bit of brown uh, in there as well to incorporate my tote that I was carrying with me. So anyway, that is my outfit for the day. Hope you guys enjoyed it and stay tuned for my tips later on this week.